Hey there everyone, welcome back to Star Viper Gaming. I'm Star Viper and today we're diving into the addictive game called Pal War. Pal World is an interesting and captivating sandbox survival game that lets you capture creatures known as pals and use them to help you around the world and in your personal base. Think of it as Ark meeting Pokemon. The game starts as any other survival game where after a quite minimalistic character customization screen, you're thrown into the world of Pal World. After that, you are pretty much free to explore the map from the start as you want and build your dream base. But before you can do that, you will have to obviously craft a primitive crafting station and get your basic farming tools. After that, your journey in gathering resources starts. Palworld would not be a true survival game if elements such as hunger, weight, health, temperature and stamina would not have been included. Although the weight system and stamina can become quite annoying sometimes because every time you gather materials, your character will get tired and will become overloaded. Loaded. Also, every time you defeat pals in the world, gather stuff or build things, you will earn experience and level up your character. Like this, you will be able to unlock new technologies and improve your stats, such as your weight capacity, your health and your attack power. Once you decide to settle down and build your base, you will have to get a pal box. This device is a core element and will let you capture a specific territory as well as store captured pals and manage them. Every time you complete different tasks, you will be able to upgrade it and it will offer you the possibility to get more pals to work for you. Another really fun aspect of the game is the ability for you to capture different creatures while exploring. To be able to do this you will have to fight them, lower their health and use a pal sphere in order for you to have a chance to make them yours. Remember though that there are different pal spheres in the game and that you will have to get better ones as you progress to be able to get more uncommon pals. In the world you will also stumble across thugs that have captured creatures in cages and once you defeat them you can free these guys and add them automatically to your pal deck and you will find treasures while exploring and wandering merchants from which you can buy different materials. After a few in-day games will pass your base will also start to get raided by thugs and sometimes by other pals. Besides the whole base protection, crafting, exploration and management, the main focus of Palworld is to actually defeat different main bosses that are inhabiting the world. These come in different variants such as the ones available in the world itself, the ones that are specific to dungeons and the main humanoid pal tamers. The main bosses are not capturable but the world bosses and dungeon ones are. So make sure to prepare some good pal spheres and some good gear as these guys will hit hard. After defeating them you will get ancient technology points that can be spent in unlocking ancient tech such as the pal incubator that is good to hatch eggs found in the wild. The pals that live in the world are extremely unique and also specific to the biomes they live in. They come in different variants from small cute critters to massive beasts. In order for you to tame them, you have to fight them and use a pal sphere to add them to your pal deck. You can carry up to 5 consecutive pals with you and each time you summon one, it will give you a boost of stats and will also have special abilities for you to use such as being able to use it as a flamethrower or a shield or even to be able to give it weapons. Not only that these creatures can be carried with you and will help you in fights, some of them are rideable and others are flyable. For this though, you will have to unlock saddles. Each of them come with specific elements to it, such as earth, darkness, electricity, ice, water and grass. They also come with secondary stats to them that will show you what tasks the critter is good in, so that you know to what job you can assign. You can also upgrade your pals using souls gathered in the world. What truly sets pal world apart is the bond that you the player can form with your pals. These adorable creatures aren't just tools for your base or battle companions, they're your friends. From petting them, feeding them, taking care of their sanity and cuddling up by the fire, the level of detail in their animations and behaviors is simply astonishing. You'll find yourself completely stunned by the level of details these lovable things have. 
We also have to stop for a moment to appreciate just how gorgeous Palworld is. The vibrant colors, lush environments, and attention to details make every moment feel like a whimsical adventure. Pair that with a charming soundtrack and sound effects that perfectly complete the on-screen actions and you've got yourself a feast for the senses. And remember that at this moment the game is only in early access so it will evolve more and probably even open up new areas. It is always a warming moment to see that the developers love what they craft and take care of it. As I wrap up this review, it's safe to say that Palworld has stolen our hearts. Its unique land of gameplay mechanics, adorable pals and stunning visuals make for an experience unlike any other. Even though I have obviously stumbled across bugs, like creatures getting stuck in rocks, bugging out in the base, becoming unresponsive while fighting them, and a lot of frame drops while exploring, it is understandable after all, because the game is still in early access. Because of this, the score of the game is an 8 out of 10. Whether you're a seasoned gamer or just looking for something new to sink your teeth into, Palworld offers endless possibilities for fun moments and creativity. So what are you waiting for? Dive in and let the adventure begin. Thank you for tuning in everyone. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, share and subscribe for more gaming content. Until next time, happy gaming.